go. Orders. Finish her. Ashley needs medical attention. We have to leave the soul system. I know. The Citadel is our best chance. We can find help there. Get us to the Citadel, Joker. Roger that. Hold on, Ash. See what you and Edie can learn from that thing. Commander, I'm receiving a signal over the secondary QEC. I believe it's Admiral Hackett. Patch me through. I'll forward it to the call room. Shepard, are you reading me? Commander. Edie, can you clear this up? I'll do my best. Did you get to the archives? I was there. So was the elusive man. I was worried Cerberus might try something. Did you get the data? Most of it. He downloaded some before I could stop him. Edie and Liara are analyzing what we recovered. What have you learned? Was it worth the effort? Preliminary evidence suggests the data is a blueprint for a Prothean device. Device? A weapon, massive in size and scope, that's capable of unquantifiable levels of destruction. Send me the data. We'll do our own analysis. If Liara's instincts are right, this might be the key to stopping the Reapers. I hope so. Lieutenant Commander Williams was critically wounded. We're taking her to the Citadel. Sorry to hear that, Shepard. But we both know this is just the beginning. Talk to the Council, show them what you found. With luck, they'll give you all the support we need. And if they don't? Do whatever it takes to get them on board. I'll be in touch soon. Hack it out. Shepard? Edie is extracting data from the Cerberus machine. We'll have details to present to the Council by the time we reach the Citadel. And Lieutenant Commander Williams? I've done what I can for her. She needs proper medical attention soon. The Admiral's right. It's going to get worse, isn't it? Unless we stop the Reapers, yeah. I've looked at the data. This weapon could be the answer, if we can build it. I get the sense you don't quite believe it, though. You didn't see what they did to Earth. How is one weapon supposed to stop them? What are our options? You know we can't win this conventionally. Shepard. Isn't it worth trying, at least? I'm gonna check on Ashley and James. Make sure we're ready to present our findings to the Council. I'm sure the Council will see the need to help. It'll be a hell of a short war if they don't.
Barely got a pulse here. Move him out. Where are you taking her? Where to Memorial. Best care in the Citadel. We're not going with? We need to see the Council. Right. Looks like they might be coming to see you. Commander Shepard. Got word you were arriving. Captain Bailey. Good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Though it's Commander now. Congratulations. Uh, thanks. Now half my job is dealing with political bullshit and escorting dignitaries around. No offense. None taken. So you're here to bring us to the Council? I'm here to tell you the Council is expecting you, but they are dealing with their own problems with the war and everything. Uh, they apologize for the inconvenience and blah, 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 blah. Meet them here at Adina's office. They'll be ready soon enough. All right. You might have time to go by the medical center if you want to check on progress over there. Thanks. I might do that. You go on ahead. I'll head up to Adina's office. One of my men can show you the way. You? I'm just a tourist today. I'll try not to get in any trouble. Commander, we've got a situation in the embassy quarters. We could use your help. Hmm. I'll be right there. The other half of my job. I'll see you around, Shepard. No doubt. Okay. That's awesome. All right. Where are we going now? We are... Ooh, look at that. All right, so we've got several things we can do. Um, let's take a look at our journal. Oh, I don't want to go to the Codex. Priority Mars is done. Secondary. Okay, Extinct Races. Mission Summary. Alright. So, map. Where do I want to go? Um, Normandy Airlock is here. Uh, passenger Lounge. Okay, Diana Allers. Security Checkpoint. Uh, all right, Councillor Rudina, patient lounge. See, I want to go to the to the medical. That's where I want to go. Um, so that's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to try to go to medical. Is this? Can I go this way? Yeah. Okay, let's, let's go to the hospital. Gotta check into my girl. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial Hospital. Alright. Wow, she's got some heavy footsteps. Thump, 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 thump. Alright. Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to Huerta Memorial Hospital. The human specialist medical officer in charge is Dr. Michel. Also, please note that specialists for all known Citadel species are on call. Please ensure that you observe proper decontamination protocols at all times while in this area. In other words, wear your mask. Okay. Okay. Any other important areas I should know about? The Normandy is currently docked in D24, which is tagged to your biometrics. Docking bay E24 has been repurposed into temporary housing to accommodate the recent influx of civilians to the Citadel. If you wish to contact your species' official Citadel representative, please go to Citadel Embassies. The Presidium Commons have been a cultural mainstay since the Council was first established at the Citadel. Okay. You can really cover treatment for any kind of species here. Huerta Memorial surpasses all requirements needed for any multi-species medical facility. This facility's attendant levels can also replicate the living conditions needed to accommodate other, more exotic species. 
Aquatic environments, for example, are available on short notice. Okay. What about the medical staff? How do they deal with so many species? All personnel are required to undergo mandatory and regular psychological evaluations, as well as refresher courses. Hospital administration understands how difficult it can be for staff to deal with such a wide variety of patients. It is imperative they be offered the support needed to retain their current high standards. Okay, what else do I have? Uh... What else is in the area? The Huerta Memorial Hospital has experts from every major race and residency, with many specializing in Xeno medicine. The facility works with prestigious medical universities from around the galaxy, offering internships to residents and nurses. With access to cutting-edge technology and support from major pharmaceutical companies, the hospital ensures the best care to its patients. Where'd the hospital get its name? It is named after President Christopher Huerta of Earth's United North American States. The donor who requested the tribute expressed the desire to remain anonymous. Okay. Thank you. Please speak with me again if you require further assistance. You got it. Here's Shepard now. Dr. Chakwas, you're here? I'm working at an Alliance R&D lab down in Shelter Woods, coordinating closely with Admiral Hackett. I heard you escaped Earth in the Normandy, and that someone was critically injured. I came as fast as I could. We had a run-in with the Cerberus Synthetic on Mars. Ashley took the worst of it. How is she doing? Very well, all things considered. I'm impressed with Lieutenant Commander Williams' resilience, as well as Dr. Michelle's expertise. I wish I could have been there to help on Mars. Been six months, Doctor. How have you been? Good. I've been fortunate. When they impounded Normandy, the Alliance didn't really know what to do with me. I was never officially part of Cerberus, and I'd gotten a proper leave of absence from my previous post. So you hadn't technically done anything wrong by joining me to defeat the Collectors? Yes. Though I suppose if you were judged to be a war criminal, I would have been tried as an accessory. Your place is in Normandy's med bay, not some lab. I couldn't agree more. You say the word and I'm with you. The Normandy wouldn't be the same without you, Doctor. Get your things. Docking bay D-24. Yes, Commander. And thank you. Don't thank me so soon. Remember, Joker's still aboard. And I'd be surprised if he's been remembering his medication. Awesome. Got Dr. Shockless. Alright, anything else? Now I gotta I gotta do this whole room before I move on. Before I thump along the lovely. Nurse tells me you've refused to bathe and you only want to talk to another Asari. Yes. Can I have a gun? I'm sorry, no. Maybe I could be transferred to another hospital then. Someplace unsecured. I could have a gun then, right? And no humans. Wherever you transfer me, it, it, it shouldn't have humans. The humans are our allies. You don't trust them? No, it's not that. I... How are my eyes? What, what, what color are they right now? Maybe you could tell me what happened. Okay, I was hoping she would tell me what happened, but... Commander Shepard, good to see you. Dr. Michelle, it's been a long time. You've come a long way from that small clinic down in the wards. Because of you, I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't dealt with Fist and his thugs. Now I met physician in the Presidium Clinic. You gave me this chance. I assume you're here about Lieutenant Commander Williams? How is Ashley doing? The head trauma was severe, but we reduced the swelling quickly. These types of injury can go either way. She hasn't regained consciousness yet, but her vitals are strong, so I'm optimistic. You can go see her if you like. She's just on the hall. This war may leave a lot of injured people homeless. Can the Citadel clinics care for them all? We're fine now, but I'm worried. Every hospital in the Citadel is preparing for the worst. I hear the docks are tightly controlled, but we just can't leave people floating out there forever. How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I can't say I'm not worried about the future. 
We've posted guards on our reserves. War profiteering has already begun. With a center of this size, you must have a lot of direct reports. We've got 12 full-time doctors and over 50 support staff. It can be overwhelming, quite different from my days in the wards. All right, that's all she's got. Keep up the good work, Doctor. You too, Commander. All right, now, I believe we came in that way, right? That's the elevator, so we came in that way. All right, um, so we're going out this way. We're going here. All right. All right. I don't know if I can talk to anybody, but. Now, can I do anything in here? I want to see what happens if I go in here. All right. All right. I can't talk to any of these people. All I can do is run by and thump at them. Thump. Thump, 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 thump. Okay. Tarian? I always pronounced it Turian. Anywho, um. Is that Ash? Yeah. You got pretty banged up there, Williams. Had me worried. I just wanted to check in on you. See how you're doing. Despite all this, it's good seeing you again, Ash. Get some rest, okay? I'll come by when you're feeling better. We'll talk. If you need anything, Doc, let me know. Okay, Ash. You take care. See you soon. Alright, what else do we got? We're gonna pop in here. Oh, we've got what do we got in here? Anything? Nope. When I ship out. I have some bad news. Your squad applied the metagel correctly, but infection had already set in by the time they found you. I'm sorry. I'm afraid we have to remove your leg. Below the knee. What? But I, I, I don't understand. It doesn't even hurt. It would if we took you off the painkillers, Lieutenant. Oh, this dude. Poor guy. Anything in here? Doesn't look like I have anything to do in here. Alright. All right, I can. That's Ash, right? So I can I can thump back to where I was going before. All right. So we're not gonna we're gonna do we're gonna go to Adina last. Uh. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Okay. Select a destination. Uh, Citadel Embassies dock. One moment, please. Okay. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. All right, and let's take a look at the map. Okay, so um, I did Huerta. I'm at the embassies. All right, I can't go anyplace else. Passenger lounge. Oh, Diana Alice is at the passenger lounge. So. I think I want to go to the dock first and go deal with Diana Allers. That's what I want to do. So we're going to go to the embassies last. So let's do this. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Let's go to the dock. All right. And they made the elevator so much faster. Now arriving at docking bay D24. All right. Okay, so we we talked to to her. Okay. First deployment is somewhere near. Reports say not to depend on comms. I'll leave vid messages then, and you can do the same. 
Well, they said that due to concerns about signal congestion, we're supposed to avoid sending messages at all. They're trying to keep war data coming through, so every data packet counts. So, how am I supposed to talk with you then? Alright, well, apparently you're not. Alright, so I'm just gonna... I'm looking at everything I can. I just don't want to miss anything. Alright, so I believe... Okay, I don't know what that is. But, uh, let me take a look at my map. And, okay, so one is the Normandy airlock. Alright, so I just go here. Passenger lounge. Alright. So that's it. So let's talk to everyone I can. But you're on the Normandy, right? I saw it docked. It was last seen on Earth. Did Commander Shepard escape? She did. What's going on here? Commander, just who I was looking for. Diana Allers, Alliance News Network. I think we can help each other. I suppose you want an interview? Even better. I'm a military reporter with a show called Battle Space. We're carried on just about all council planets. My producers want me embedded on a human ship, and I want that ship to be the Normandy. Why would I want that? Wars can be won or lost in the editing room, and this war needs to be won. I've got Alliance security clearance and operate without a crew. You get veto power over the segments I file. Can you handle an arrangement like that? I or can. Or do I keep looking? Tell your producers yes for now. We'll see how it works out. Report to the ship as soon as possible. Any questions? How much gear can I bring? One footlocker. Aye, aye, Commander. Good grief. And my good grief, by the way, was for that dress, because, jeez, that was a nice dress. That was a very, very, very nice dress. That was an extremely nice dress. Whew. Yeah. Okay, Please now the we're going moment. going to the embassies. All right. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. All right, so where am I? I am here, and five. I've got the office suite. I've got Council Ladina. So Council Ladina is in two. So that's right there. So I want to do that last. So basically, what I'm going to do is going to go five, four. All right, so we'll hit five and four. Let's do that. So five is Jesus Christ. My spatial. Right, this is the way I want to go. Okay. Please tell the primacy that the Vol Protectorate wishes to assist with the Alliance project. We had a Prothean obelisk that might have helped. Sadly, it was lost in the Shrike Abyssal. Nevertheless, we are committed to helping both the Turian Empire and the Human Alliance. Okay. Anybody else got anything to say? You guys? Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Fine. Um, we'll go this way. Who the hell is calling me disgraced and who is talking about theoretical? Alright. Carry on, boys. Hello, dear. Perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for my son. But we spoke about this already. I told you about his mission and nonsense. I just filled out the paperwork. He's very punctual when he's on the field. He checks in every week. Only he hasn't checked in for a while now. A month. Anyway, I'd like to file an expedited contact request. Yes, of course, ma'am. But the notes on his file state he's not under a contact ban. Oh, you already looked. How kind of you. I'm just so worried. It's not like him to go quiet. As soon as I get news, ma'am, I'll let you know as soon as I get news. Thank you. Oof. Such a nice young woman. You know, you remind me of my daughter. 
Okay. Who is? What is that? Oh, okay. Um, it's a Batari. All right, so we're going that way. Next episode. All right. Thanks for watching, and I will see you then. Peace.